am an asshole for not asking my biological father's permission to get married. My biological father and I have never been in great terms with each other. He is mean and hurtful and really only calls me when it can possibly benefit him. When I was 7 to 12, he told me that my mother didn't want me because I was too black. For context, my mother had married a white man and she had three other children from previous marriages who happened to be of the lighter persuasion. My biological parents divorced when I was three and my biological father got primary custody of me after I was raped at four by her new ex-husband. He told me that she didn't want me and that's why she didn't call or try to visit. At 12, I got to visit my mom and ask her why she didn't want me. It was then that she showed me all the documentation and returned to send her letters from years of denied communication. She had fought for me and ended up losing custody because she ran out of money to fight. My father lied to me about him having sole custody when they had joint custody. He had been telling my mother that I didn't want to see her and that I was refusing to visit, while telling me that she didn't want me and that I wasn't loved. At 12, I asked my father to send to be with my mother. Apparently, he wasn't letting me go without a fight. He threw me into a wall, took my phone and quite literally dragged me up and down the hall of our apartment by my hair. Let me remind you, I was freaking 12 years old. A neighbor saw and called 911. My mother was given custody immediately and I was sent to live with her. Fast forward and now I am grown and happy. My stepfather raised me with my siblings and taught me how men were supposed to treat women. I modeled my relationships after his and my mother's because their unconditional love for each other is something to aspire to. My stepfather was there for every talent show, every play. He taught me how to drive and how to throw a right hook. For all intents and purposes, this man is my dad and father. I have with my now fiancé for two and a half years. He has met my mom, stepfather and biological father. Before he got engaged, he asked for my stepfather and my biological mother's blessing. Of course, they gave their blessing. My guy is one hell of a guy. With my permission, we decided to leave my biological father out of it because in our opinion, he doesn't deserve that honor, nor will he receive an invitation. My stepfather will be walking me down the aisle because he earned that position. Fast forward to the next morning, my mother asked if she could announce it to the family. I said yes, of course. Following the announcement, my parental aunt asked me if my man had asked my biological father. I responded with no because he has to be a father to be treated like one. She said that asking my stepfather for his blessing and not my biological father was disrespectful and inappropriate. She also said that I shouldn't be engaged at all without his blessing. So am I the asshole for not asking my biological father's blessing?